Hello everyone, I'm Jen, your Delaware Realtor. Welcome to a brand new community tour. We are at Spring Mill in Middletown, Delaware. If you are interested in this community, I would absolutely love the opportunity to help you. My information is down below in the description. Feel free to reach out. Welcome to Spring Mill in Middletown, Delaware. This is a 55 plus community. It's about 19 years old, so as we're driving through, you're gonna see a lot of mature trees, a lot of really, really great landscaping. Um, and we're just gonna talk a little bit about the neighborhood as we drive through here. So there are about 362 homes in here. They are all single family homes that sit on about 0.24 acres but not to worry because all of your landscaping and snow removal grass cutting all of that is all taken care of with your HOA fee so you don't even have to worry about any of the outdoor maintenance at all which is great right it's low maintenance living <music> homes so they all consist of the master bedroom being on the first floor with the bathroom and a two-car garage now some of these homes do have basements most of them are on slabs um, but some of them do have basements and some of them do have a second story whether that be two bedrooms upstairs or one bedroom no bathroom upstairs so just keep that in mind. It all depends on what you are looking for. This is a great community as a great location. It is minutes from all of your major shopping. So Walmart, Target, Wawa, Lowe's, Home Depot, everything you could basically think of. And it is very close to the Christiana Hospital and the Christiana ER. So they have a satellite hospital uh, which is probably around like five to ten minutes away from here So no no worries on getting to the hospital and also they have plenty of doctor's offices uh, with locations in Middletown, so Not to worry if you need to get to a doctor's appointment. It's very very close by <music> in here is around four hundred and twenty four thousand dollars which is actually under 
the median home price for all of Middletown. So you actually are getting a little bit of a deal by moving in here. The homes in here sell very, very quickly. So just keep that in mind. If you are interested in this community, they tend to go very quickly depending on the condition of the home. So another thing that I actually really, really love about this community is that I know I mentioned the HOA fee. Included in your HOA fee, there is a pool. <laughs> There's a huge clubhouse. It has horseshoe pits, bocce ball, tennis courts. There are walking trails and sidewalks throughout the entire community. So if you are into your daily walking or maybe you're into running, this community is perfect for that. It, it basically is all connected. So there's like two sides to the community. So there is two entrances as well. Uh, the one entrance is right next to the clubhouse and the second entrance is not very far away. So it's right off of 71, which is the actually the main road that goes right into Middletown. So like I said, it's really, really close. You're close to the library. So if you do want to go to the Apoquinimic Library, it's brand new. It's got so many different things going on. There is uh, a new YMCA that is being built right next to the uh, library. And it is gonna have an indoor track, a pool. It's gonna be absolutely amazing. I cannot wait for that. So I know we talked a little bit about the home prices. The home prices in this community have gone up about 4% in the last 12 months which is right on par actually for all of Middletown. So while it may be, may get in here for cheaper than where you would in Middletown, your home value will, is right on par with the home values of all of Middletown. I have sold a few homes in here. Everyone is so nice. They lay, you'll see everyone walking around, they wave to you. Very, very welcoming. You actually, there is a welcome committee, I believe. When you do move in here, they, they actually stop by to welcome you to the community. Basically to tell you everything about the community, tell you about the how to get into the clubhouse. They have a lot of groups and activities that go on around here. So like if you uh, wanted to join a club, like a, like a book club or tennis club or anything like that they have all of that uh, within this community which is great right especially when you're retired the last thing you want to do is worry about your yard and maintenance right like it's so much easier to just be able to come home and your grass is already cut and like take it from me who I <laughs> live on two acres I can honestly say like it takes a lot of time to cut the grass. <laughs> I'm all about low maintenance living. So we are, we just passed the entrance, this the first entrance. We're gonna go on the second half of the community. Not every home looks the same in here. There are some that are brick, some of them are, have vinyl. Some of them have two car garages, meaning two doors. And some of them is just one big door, but it is still a two car garage. So don't worry. You'll always have a two car garage in here. And they do uh, allow for trucks in there because that one home that I sold, um, the gentleman who purchased the home was actually looking to make sure that his truck fit into the garage and we measured and it did. And <laughs> that was one of the reasons why he ended up purchasing in here. So not to worry if you have a truck. So when I said everything is connected, there's really only two main roads in this community. The rest of them will have a roundabout or cul-de-sac at the end of the roads so that there's no chance of getting lost. You'll be fine. <laughs> Some of these homes do back up to what I would call woods. Um, I, I guess you would call them woods. 
So if you are looking for a little bit of privacy, there are homes in here that do offer that. Everyone's grass looks so nice. Landscaping. I've been in so many of these homes. The pool here is absolutely gorgeous and it's a pretty big pool. You could wake up in the morning, go do morning laps and still enjoy the rest of your day. Or you could go to the Y, like I said, which is not very far away and they're building a, we already have a Y, but they are building a brand new one, which is going to be huge and gorgeous and I cannot wait for it. There are plenty of people in Middletown that are very, like very much looking forward <laughs> to this Y being built. What we're gonna do is I'm gonna bring you to the second entrance and then we'll go back to the first one so you can kind of take a look around. So the one thing that I should mention is if you are looking for a community that allows you to have a fence, this community does not allow you to have a fence and it's because they do the lawn maintenance. Uh, they don't want to weave in and out of fences but I've seen plenty of patios and people have put like kind of like railings around their patios so if you do have animals that might work for you plenty of paver patios and concrete patios so this entrance does have a light so we're gonna stop here and then I'll show you so across the street is what's called best materials it is like for land like landscaping uh, patio Equipment and I can turn on red here. In Delaware, you can turn on red, just a heads up. <laughs> All right, and then we're gonna go head down to the first entrance. This one does not have a light. So we'll see the beautiful Spring Mill sign. That is the clubhouse right there. And then I'm gonna pull into the clubhouse. This person go. Alrighty, and that concludes our tour. Thank you so much for watching this community tour. Once again, if you are interested in this community and would like more information, my information is down below in the description. I really hope that this video helped. If it did, be sure to give me a thumbs up, be sure to subscribe to the channel, and I will see you on the next one.